In this video, I will show you an easy way how you can get easy light rays in your Blender scene in both the EV and Cycles render engine. Let's go. Currently, we are in this little nature scene that you can see that I've set up. It looks really nice, but I'm missing the light rays in the scene, or for example, you can call them God rays. So how are we going to add them? Most people add them by adding a cube with a volume scatter node or a principal volume node. But those don't really work for me most of the time. And also it takes a long time to render. So here's a different way how to do it. First, we will add a cube to our scene. Then let's give it a new material and call it light rays. Then add a new window and change it to the shader editor. In here, let's delete the principal BSDF and add a new emission node and plug this into the volume node of the material output. Then let's add a Voronoi texture like this and add a color ramp in between like this. Also, you should add a mapping and a texture coordinate node to the four node texture. If you have the node wrangler add-on enabled, it's control T to do so. Now, if we go back to our blender scene, you can see the new material that we added to our cube. And it already looks a little bit foggy and that's exactly what we want, but it doesn't look right yet. So let's change some settings. Let's set the Voronoi texture to 4D and extend the scale to 13. Then in the mapping node, set the scale of the Z axis to zero and play around a bit with the color ramp until you get nice lines in the material like this. I personally want my light rays to be coming from the side of the screen. So I will rotate my cube a little bit to look as if the light rays are coming from the side. There might be a chance that when you scale your cube to a different size and you go back into the camera view, that the light rays seem glitched. Well, if you go to the fully shaded view, you can see that the light rays are actually still okay, but somehow in the material view, they look a little bit off. So keep that in mind. And as you can see, we have created some really easy and nice God rays or light rays in our scene. To give these light rays a little bit extra spice, you can go back to the material that you just created and change the color of the color ramp from white to, I will change it to a little bit yellowish green tinted vibe so that it gives more of the forest vibe. And as you can see, this is our current scene. Currently, we are in the Psychos render engine. And as you can see, it works. But does it also work in the EV render engine? Well, let's change our render engine to EV. And as you can see, the glitch starts happening again. But if we render out our scene, you can clearly see that the, that the light rays work out just fine. So that's also something you can keep in mind to not believe everything that you see on your screen. So I hope that this video was helpful to you in some way. If you have still any questions, feel free to place them in the comments below and I will try to answer every single one. Good luck with your renders and bye.